Now, Neptune can work with a MIDI input to help you achieve more accurate pitch correction and voice synthesis. Now, there are two ways to uh, work with this. The MIDI destination button here, the first option that you have is to send MIDI to the pitch adjust. And I've got my MIDI keyboard connected. But before I can do any of that, what I have to do is I have to create a sequencer track for Neptune because as it is, it's an audio effect and it can't receive MIDI signal without having a sequencer track. So I'll right click on it and choose create track for Neptune 1. And here we go. So this now gives us a way to record MIDI. And now if I play my keyboard, you can see that it's able to receive input notes. And essentially what you can do is you can force the pitch correction to conform to the notes that you're pressing on the keyboard. So let's see how that works in practice. Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. So I started off playing the same notes as the singer was singing, but then towards the end, I changed them. And again, you just have to kind of mess about with these settings to try and find the optimum. It depends on the kind of material you're working with. Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. It can sound a little bit strange sometimes, and other times it sounds okay. It's just a case of fiddling with it until you get it right a lot of the time, which isn't ideal, but it's not an exact science. So that is quite an interesting way of forcing pitch correction to bend to your will, as it were. You can actually record MIDI notes into the sequencer track. So if I was to record that, I'd be able to repeat the effect. Superstar, superstar on the dance floor. And if I double click on the MIDI part, those are the notes I recorded, and that MIDI is now being routed into Neptune to tell it how to pitch correct. So if I play back. Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. And if I was to move one of those, I could change the pitch correction. Star on the dance floor. You get the idea with that. So I'm just going to momentarily get rid of that because I don't want it. The second thing that you can do, which is pretty cool, is to use it as a voice synth. Now, if I press the MIDI button again, I could send the MIDI to the voice synthesizer. Now, initially, if I play it, it will be both. Superstar. What happens is I get both the original signal and the voice synth signal. What I'm doing is I'm pressing MIDI keys on my keyboard and it's using the signal of the original vocal and repitching it based on the notes that I'm playing. And the cool part is that you can play polyphonic parts even though the vocal is monophonic. So if I, for example, turn the pitch signal all the way down, we can get rid of the original vocal and I can actually play the new one as if it was a vocoder. Of course, the audio only sounds when I press a note. So uh, let's try that again. So you can see that you can completely change the way that a part sounds. And I could have recorded that as well. I can record that MIDI into a track. And again, it would then repeat as it played back. Let's try that. Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. And the good thing about recording it is that it then enables you to go in and just mess with these settings until you get it sounding a bit better. So let's try that. Superstar, superstar. Superstar on the dance floor. Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. 
Superstar, superstar, superstar on the dance floor. Superstar, superstar. And if you were to spin the rack around and take the voice synth outputs from Neptune to a new mix channel, what you could do is you could have the synthesized sound routing separately into the mixer and the original sound going where it was always going from Neptune. So you end up with two mix channels, one of which has your original possibly pitch corrected voice on it. The second one has the harmonies. So that's a really great way to control and create harmonies from a single monophonic vocal track using Neptune.